For as long as we've existed, humans have looked up in wonder, captivated by the mysteries above. We've always asked the big questions, how did we get here? Is there anyone else out there? Our quest led us from humble telescopes to the groundbreaking James Webb Space Telescope, JWS. JWS isn't just another observatory, it's a giant leap for science. A golden eye in the cosmos crafted by thousands over decades. Its enormous, gold-plated mirror gathers more light than any before, allowing us to peer deeper and further into space than ever imagined. JWS acts as a time traveler, a cosmic detective, and a map maker, built to uncover the universe's most profound secrets. The excitement before its launch was electric. This telescope was set to reveal the first light of the cosmos and hunt for life on distant planets. Its journey and intricate unfolding a million miles from home marked only the start of its mission. Now, the breathtaking images and data it beams back aren't just stunning, they're rewriting what we know about the universe. JWST stands as more than a tool. It's a testament to our endless curiosity and our boldness to venture into the unknown. It shows what humanity can accomplish when we unite in pursuit of discovery. And already it's uncovered something so astonishing, it's left scientists utterly amazed. Before JWS launched, excitement buzzed through the scientific community. It was built to be a time machine. Light takes time to travel, so looking farther means looking back in time. JWS was designed to capture the faint light from the first galaxies, over 13.5 billion years ago. Its mission, witness the universe's birth, see the first stars ignite, and watch galaxies evolve. This cosmic dawn is a missing chapter in our history, and JWS lets us finally read it. Another goal, study exoplanets by analyzing starlight passing through their atmospheres, searching for biosignatures like water or methane. The possibility of finding a planet with an Earth-like atmosphere is one of science's most thrilling prospects. JWS marks a shift from speculation to direct observation, letting us test our biggest ideas about the universe and life beyond Earth. It's a new era of discovery, unlocking secrets hidden since the dawn of time. Everyone who worked on JWS knew they were building a new window for humanity. How does JWST work its magic? It sees the universe in infrared light, invisible to our eyes. Infrared vision is crucial, like night vision goggles for the cosmos, letting JWST see what Hubble can't. Why infrared? First, the universe's expansion stretches ancient light into the infrared so only a powerful infrared telescope can see the first galaxies. Second, infrared pierces through cosmic dust revealing star nurseries and planetary birth hidden from visible light telescopes. To do this, JWST must stay incredibly cold. Any warmth would blind its sensitive detectors. Its tennis court-sized sunshield blocks heat from the sun, moon, and earth, cooling the telescope to minus 233 degrees Celsius. This extreme cold lets JWS detect faint signals from the edge of the universe. It's an engineering marvel, built to see the invisible and tell the universe's greatest stories. With JWS we're not just seeing farther, we're seeing what was once impossible to imagine. This new vision is already rewriting our understanding of the cosmos, and it's only just begun. For decades, Hubble was our legendary eye in the sky, transforming our view of the universe, but JWS isn't Hubble's replacement, it's its successor, building on Hubble's discoveries and answering new questions. Hubble sees mostly visible and ultraviolet light. JWST is a master of the infrared, revealing what Hubble can't. Think of Hubble as sharp eyesight and Webb as having cosmic night vision. JWST's mirror is over six times larger, collecting more light and seeing fainter, farther objects. While Hubble orbits close to Earth, JWST sits a million miles away at a stable point, free from Earth's interference. This lets JWS tackle questions Hubble couldn't, like seeing the very first galaxies and studying exoplanet atmospheres in detail. Hubble showed us the universe's expansion. JWST lets us witness its beginnings. It's a new generation of telescope for a new generation of cosmic mysteries. Hubble walked so Webb could run, and now Webb is running into the unknown. With its incredible power, JWST began scanning the universe's oldest regions and found something astonishing. It identified three objects that appear to be dark stars, a theoretical type of star powered not by fusion, but by dark matter annihilation. For years, dark stars were a fringe idea thought unlikely to exist. The theory, in the early universe, dense clouds of dark matter could power giant, cool, and incredibly bright stars. 
These stars would be millions of times more massive than our sun, but much cooler on the surface. No one expected to find one, until now. JWST found three objects from the universe's cosmic dawn, far too bright to be normal stars or galaxies. Their light signatures matched models of supermassive dark stars almost perfectly. Suddenly, the unthinkable became a real possibility, dark stars hiding in plain sight. This discovery has sent shockwaves through astronomy. The potential discovery of dark stars is a paradigm shift, challenging our fundamental story of the early universe. Until now, we thought the first stars were fusion-powered giants, kick-starting galaxy formation. But if dark stars existed first, our cosmic timeline needs rewriting. Powered by dark matter, these giants could grow far larger than normal stars, possibly explaining the rapid appearance of supermassive black holes. When a dark star runs out of fuel, it could collapse directly into a massive black hole, giving these cosmic monsters a head start. This also has huge implications for dark matter itself. If dark stars exist, it's the first real evidence for a specific type of dark matter particle. It turns a cosmic mystery into a particle physics breakthrough. The universe's biggest puzzles may be more connected than we ever imagined, and JWST is the key to unlocking them. If confirmed, dark stars would rewrite our cosmic story. These massive objects would have shaped their surroundings, influencing how the first galaxies formed. The cosmic web we see today might trace back to the placement of these ancient giants. Maybe the universe's first light came not from fusion, but from dark matter annihilation. This discovery forces us to rethink our models and search strategies as we push JWST to its limits. Dark matter may be more than a passive scaffold, it could be an active creator of cosmic structures. Studying these stars could reveal the properties of dark matter in ways impossible on Earth. The universe itself becomes our laboratory, offering clues to its deepest mysteries. With JWS, we're not just observing, we're experimenting on a cosmic scale. The implications stretch far beyond astronomy. Discoveries like dark stars are why we explore. They're the surprises that push science forward. Every time we build a better instrument, the universe rewards us with new mysteries and challenges. Our knowledge is always incomplete, and that's what drives us. Finding dark stars doesn't end a story, it sparks a dozen new ones. Now, astronomers worldwide will race to confirm and understand these objects, fueling years of research and discovery. This quest isn't just for scientists, it's for everyone. Each new discovery enriches us, reminding us we're part of something vast and mysterious. Looking at JWS's images connects us to the cosmos and inspires the next generation of explorers. The journey of discovery is endless. JWS is just the latest step. There will be more surprises, more unthinkable findings, and that's a wonderful thing because the greatest discoveries are still ahead, waiting for us to look up.